What's up everybody, Mike McIntyre here back with another unboxing video. This is another model in the brand new Adidas Spectral Mode Pack Collection. I'm super excited to see you all here. I'm super pumped to bring you another unboxing and review. I love giving you guys all this new content, so hit that subscribe button and let's get into it. If you're interested in picking these up for yourself, be sure to check out that first link down below in the description. I have to give a big thanks to Evangelista Sports for sponsoring this video. So there's a quick look at the Adidas Nemesis 18 Plus. That's all the information you need to know. This is the Plus model, so you get a fancier slide out box right there. Let's get the cleats out of the box. Let's take the paper out as well right off the bat so we don't have to worry about that later. This is a nice string bag from Adidas. I am personally a fan of it. It does say Nemesis along the right side. It does say Adidas along the left. Down here it says that the color treatment will begin to wear off over time with use. That is of course talking about the sole plate material and the sort of paint coating that they give it just to give it that unique finish. The string bag does have that seam down the middle to separate the left and right compartments. And that is all you need to know about that. There's the Nemesis 18 Plus. There's a quick look at the Spectral Mode Pack colorway. This is really unique and honestly, after seeing all the boots in person, I think this one might be my favorite. I was a fan of the Wolf Gray Nike Pack that came out a while ago. I just like the sort of gray boot overall. I think it's unique. I think it's a little bit different. And I think the Ds did a really good job with this boot right here. So the Nemesis 18 Plus, I've done a review on these bad boys before. So if you want to check out a more detailed review, I'll leave a link to that one right up here in the right hand corner so you can check it out. I'll go over tech specs quickly in this video, but given that I've already done it, I won't go too in depth. So the Adidas 18 Plus Nemesis right here is sort of just a cleanup, I guess, of last year's boot. They just tweaked a few things here and there to sort of refine it and make it a little bit better overall. So you, we do have a higher collar this time around, as you can see. It still uses that sort of tape upper design as its inspiration. It gets, you know, it takes that um, stretchy, elasticated tape bandage system, wraps the boot entirely, that makes up the upper, but they've extended the collar piece a little bit just to give you a little bit more step in comfort, a little bit more lockdown, I suppose, as well, wrapping your foot a little bit more in this laceless model. You do have a brand new material up here in the forefoot, so they call this the Agility Knit 2.0. So it's a little bit different, I suppose, than the first time around. It does feel softer, in my opinion, a little bit softer to the touch. It's not the thinnest material I've ever felt, but it will do a good job of providing you with a nice feel on the ball while still being durable and soft overall. The stud pattern down here is a torsion frame, I suppose. Once again, it's another fancy version, I suppose, of the speed frame that Adidas has been using for years. I definitely think this is a stud pattern that they should stick to. The shapes of the studs themselves, I can take or leave. I'm not, you know, I'm indifferent about that. I just like the way they're laid out. You have four in the heel, three on both the lateral and medial sides, one pivot stud in the middle. You have the stiffener bars that run through the midfoot, just giving you that stability. And it gives the boot the lightweight. It gives the boot an amazing amount of traction. And I really think that that's a winner. One of the best stud patterns. I've said it before, probably my, my favorite stud pattern that I've ever used really. So. That's pretty much it guys for tech specs in this video. If you wanna talk a little bit more in depth about the colorway, there's not much to say. It's a very flat, grayish material. I think it looks really good. The camera actually does a pretty good job of sort of mimicking what the color looks like in real life. You have the Nemesis branding down there. I think it just, it looks really cool. It's unique, it's very different like I said before. I'm gonna slip these boots on. We'll talk about fit and feel and give you guys a quick look at what they look like on feet. So the Nemesis 18 Plus, when you put the boot on right away, it's a very comfortable boot that I think most people will sort of be surprised by. I don't think a lot of people think about the Nemesis as being a comfortable boot. And I do think that overall, it might be slightly overlooked on the market. It does have a little bit more sort of pro player support, I suppose, in the last little while. You've got Messi wearing it, obviously. But other than him in the past, no one else was really marketing it. You've got Lingard in it now. You've got a few other big names in it. So I think it's a very respectable boot. It's comfortable, it's padded. It's kind of like the middle ground in Adidas' lineup. You've got the X model, which is kind of like the old F50, their speed boot. And then of course you have the Predator. And this one sort of just falls in the middle. It's comfortable, it's light, 
It's not quite as padded as the Predator, but not nearly as thin as the X. So if you find yourself sort of wanting a boot that falls in between those two categories and you're interested in an Adidas model, this is definitely one I think you should look at. It's comfortable, it fits true to size. Adidas is always very consistent with their sizing, so go true to size if you're interested in picking up a pair for yourself. That's it guys, that's my review and unboxing of the Adidas Nemesis 18 Plus. Be sure to check out that first link down below in the description. That's pretty much it for this video. I'm Mike McIntyre from All Things Sports. Stay tuned. Hit the subscribe button. I've got some more great content for you coming. I love having you guys here with me. I hope you enjoyed the review. And until that next time, I'm signing out. Take care. Peace.